Hey, this is Presh Walker. A bottle with a cylindrical base is partially filled with water and placed on a flat surface. The height of the bottle is 21 centimeters and the height of the water is 12 centimeters. The water is completely contained within the cylindrical portion of the bottle. If the bottle is flipped upside down, then the height of the water is 15 centimeters. The question is what fraction of the bottle is full with water? I saw this problem on Reddit homework help. Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try. And when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. At first, it seems impossible to solve the problem because we don't know the radius of the cylindrical base and there's no way that we can measure the volume of the irregularly shaped top part of the bottle. The key insight to solving this problem is that the amount of air in both bottles is equal. Therefore, let's calculate the height of the air in the second bottle. Since the total bottle has a height equal to 21, the height of the air is equal to 21 minus 15, which is equal to 6 centimeters. So now we can imagine a bottle that's just cylindrical. We know that it would measure 12 centimeters of just water, and we would have 6 centimeters of air. So from here, we can figure out the fraction of the bottle that is water. The total height of this bottle will be 12 plus 6, which is equal to 18. So the fraction that's water is 12 over 18, which is equal to 2 over 3. And that's the answer. Thanks for making us one of the best communities on YouTube. See you next episode of Mind Your Decisions, where we solve the world's problems one video at a time.